once again convey our hearty congratulations to His Excellency, the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Muhammad Buhari, GCFR, on his re-election in the February 23rd, 2019 presidential election. We also want to congratulate ourselves and indeed all members of the National Assembly for their election and re-election. We are delighted, especially by the fact that our party, the APC, has secured a comfortable majority with national spread in both chambers of the National Assembly. We accordingly congratulate the national leadership of our party, the APC, and pledge our loyalty, preparedness, and determination to foster smooth executive legislative relations and facilitate the implementation of the programs of our party going forward. Gentlemen of the press, we are not unaware of the interests this issue of the leadership of the next assembly has generated in the public space. We want to use this medium to acknowledge the supremacy of our party, the APC, in addressing the issue of zoning of positions in an equitable, just, and fair manner that will foster unity and cordial relations among our party members and our colleagues from the other political divides. We are confident of the ability and capacity of the national leadership of the APC to do right to all in order to advance national cohesion, balance of power, and federal character. It is in this regard that we humbly wish to appeal to our great party, the APC, to strongly consider the North Central Geopolitical Zone for the position of Speaker of the House of Representatives in the Ninth Assembly. Yes, sir. Our position is based on the following reasons. The first is that zoning the position of Speaker to the North Central will satisfy and advance the cause of equity since the Northwest and Southwest have the President and the Vice President, respectively. We note that apart from the Northwest and Northeast, the North Central Zone delivered handsomely for the party in the just concluded general elections. As such, needs to be rewarded for the hard work and loyalty we have given to the party. Secondly, the need to ensure balance and spread between and among the six geopolitical zones has made it imperative to give prime consideration to North Central Zone to produce the position of Speaker, House of Representatives. Being the zone with delicate and peculiar locations and challenges within the Federation, it is of utmost importance to carry us along in the hierarchy of power distribution in the country as this way in no small measure helped in stabilizing the polity. Third, it is not by coincidence that the Nigerian Constitution enshrines federal character in the distribution of offices and leadership positions in the country. Section 14 sub 4 of the ground norm speaks eloquently to this fact. The North Central Geopolitical Zone would feel a sense of belonging if it is allowed to produce a speaker in the next assembly. Why we believe the reasons advanced above are very cogent and persuasive enough, we reiterate that our call for the North Central to produce the next speaker of the House is an appeal to the sense of justice, fair play, and equity of our great party. We are mindful of the fact that events that surrounded the emergence of leaders of previous assemblies can provide ample guides for our great party to avoid pitfalls and engender harmony, peace, and stability in the House of Representatives as partners in progress with the executive arm. Thank you all.